Because the company truly is the team's thing. It's, it's not mine. And I think that when, you know, at the art, like I, I truly feel that we found the people who feel that same way. Like they really like love what this company stands for and what, what hopefully it can become. My name is Arthel Isom. I'm the CEO and art director here at the Art Statue. We started with an empty room and a whole bunch of like boxes and things on the floor. <laughs> you know, we just had like a whole bunch of animators and things just kind of sitting around. And we were like, okay, we, we need to figure out where were the animators are going to sit and where are, gonna, where are our art directors going to sit. You have to have a really good team. I think that's really important for the survival of a company. You really need to rely on the people who are moving the ship forward. If the team is willing to keep trying hard and to, and to keep investing in it, the energy that's required for the project, then the project will succeed, no matter no matter the difficulties. And I think a very that only a really good team has that. If you have a team that that believes in that, and they, and they believe in the company, and they believe in, in what the company stands for, then you will. I think your company will last for a long time. The art studio means the art studio. That's the simplest way to think about it. And then in Japanese, stagio, so we have a, a different spelling, is S-H-T-A-J-I-O. Stagio is based from the kanji, which we use in background painting. It means the base, the underpainting, so staji. So staji means the underpainting, so we kind of take that for the foundation. So the, the art stagio is kind of like the foundation of art. And we kind of, that's like our base and our, our ideology kind of forms from that. So we, one of our sayings is like, staji ga daiji, so the foundation is important. Everything that we do, we kind of start from that process. Like if we're writing a story or we're, um, we, when we go into the storyboard phase, we're going to the painting phase, we always think about the base first. So like telling a, how do you tell a, a character-driven story? You have to first think about the base of this character, right? You have to think about what, what um, where did they come from? You know, before you can just kind of come up with a cool design. But before you think about their color, before you think about all of that, there's always the foundation, which is like where the focus should always be. And we, we really believe in that. The thing that inspires me with art is actually the process of art. It's probably why I enjoy the challenge of starting a company as well. Like I think the process of things is what inspires me to do them. So I really, I enjoy trying to figure things out and and actually taking those steps. Like I think that's like the most enjoyable thing for me. You have to think about it very clearly, have a very clear vision of what you want. And then once you have a clear vision of what you want, then a very clear ideology and process and map image of how you're going to get what you want. And if you can do that, then I think you can do anything. <laughs>